John, thanks so much for joining us. Of course. Um, you. Now, John, you're best known for stuff like Step Up 3, mm -hmm. 3D, Step Up 2, yeah. Justin Bieber, Never Say Never. Yes. G.I. Joe. <laughs> 3D re retaliation. Yes. The Biebs to Bruce. Yes. <laughs> it's crazy. It's crazy. Um, How did that happen? I, I'm a really good con man, and I tricked them into letting me direct this movie. No, um, I, you know, I, it sort of happened naturally. I think that um, G.I. Joe, from the very beginning, has been a part of my life. Um, yeah. I've played with it in my backyard, and I'm convinced that I learned to love storytelling by playing with my toys. Yeah, tell me about that, because mm -hmm. I read that about you, and I was intrigued by that, because we all do that, but then we don't yes. all become directors. <laughs> yeah, I, I think it was, um, I think I played with toys a lot, and I actually got a camera at the time, so yeah. I would make little animations and stuff, and. I just, um, as, as a as a sh shy little kid, it gave me yeah. a voice to to be creative, and I think that's that's the power of what GI Joe does, and that's yeah. what I hope this movie, you know, as crazy it is and wild as it is, I just hope that it, it makes kids want to go home and play yeah. and get their kids their friends together and, and 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 get their toys together and create because I know that GI Joe for me um, definitely sparked that in my brain. Yeah. Now you mentioned wild, you mentioned crazy. Yes. I was watching some of those action scenes going. Was he nuts <laughs> coordinating all this stuff? Especially, okay, there, there's a lot of big action scenes. Yes. But there's one on a mountain. Yes. I was watching that going, how? <laughs> how do you do that? How do you make that happen? Yeah, that's that's um, that's a lot, a lot of people working on those sections together. But I mean, it comes we, from you to begin with. Yeah, and, and we had a fun playtime. I mean, literally it started with, we got all the couches and the chairs in a room and we set it up as a mountain would be set up and we had two ninja toys and we yeah. were like, okay, he's gonna swing from here to here. And then we had climbing experts say, okay, we have to rig this, this, this and that. And then our ILM guys then designed the mountain, what it would look like. And then we had to work with our stunt guys of what we could actually shoot. We built zip lines a thousand feet in the air in Whistler in Vancouver, where they would actually zip line. Um, and, uh, and then we had stunt guys swinging on a green screen. I mean, it was a collaboration that went over months and months of shooting wow. and months and months of post to come together. And why 3D? Um, you know, it started, we started 2D actually. We shot on film. We wanted to feel the grain of the world. And as we started to put it all together, we realized the power of our movie was uh, bringing the audience into our story, bringing the audience onto a worldwide adventure, an adventure yeah. they could never go on in real life. And, uh, and 3D only played that up. 3D only made the adventure more immersive. It only took you to the mountains of the Himalayas, give you a little vertigo there. It only took you to the deserts of Pakistan and made the sand feel in between your, your, your toes. Yeah. Um, all that only enhanced this uh, our movie and made it better. So uh, it was a hard decision, but uh, last year when uh, we decided to switch it, it was, it was uh, it, we knew that it was a lot of work ahead of us and we took every frame very seriously and, and tried to make the audience come on the adventure with us. You have an amazing cast. Yes. I need to start with Channing Tatum. I'm not giving anything away. What are you doing <laughs> killing him off 10, 15 minutes into the film? We like surprises. That was very brave. We, 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 we like surprises and, and movies are, and you probably have to see the movie to know exactly what happens to uh, Mr. Tatum, but uh, you know, we, uh, we, I always love movies that, 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 that go against what you expect, and and we wanted to make people know that the GI Joes are not safe. Nobody is safe in the cast, and that when you're going in this adventure, um, there is real danger. Because as crazy and and fun and uh, wild we get, uh, there is a real real things are at stake. So. And finally, Dwayne Johnson, yes. Bruce Willis inspired yes. casting. Crazy, right? I mean, talk about a master class in action movies. To have yeah. the legend and the icon, Bruce Willis and The Rock, together in one movie. Uh, and then you throw in a bunch of ninjas around them. <laughs> I mean, I had to pinch myself for sure. And I would watch the monitors while we're shooting, and I'd forget that it's our movie that we're working on. And I wouldn't even call cut. i just keep watching. So uh, I hope people get to uh, experience that. And especially in 3D, you get to fight next to Dwayne. You get to fight next to Bruce. Yeah. And you get to fight with the ninjas. So I hope everybody enjoys that. Well, John, I'm so glad you enjoyed making uh, yeah, I had way too well. much fun. Way Thank you much. so much for spending time with us. Thank you. Thanks.